They say Isaac Newton discovered how light works. But six centuries before him, a Muslim scientist named Ibn al-Haytham had already done it. Born in Basra in the 10th century, he wrote Kitab al-Manazir, the Book of Optics, where he proved that light travels in straight lines. And that vision happens when light enters the eye, not when our eyes shoot rays out, a myth even Aristotle believed. He experimented with mirrors, lenses, and refraction, and built the camera obscura, the earliest model of today's cameras. His methods were so advanced, modern scientists call him the first true physicist and the father of the scientific method. When Europlater translated his books into Latin, they called him Alhazen and slowly erased the rest of his name. They say Europe discovered light, but the truth is they just found it shining in Ibn al-Haytham's pages.